Thank you for joining us here this afternoon in Larnaca at the uh, Anchor Heart uh, statue, a gift from the people of Odessa. In a few moments, um, Foreign, Foreign Minister Katalidis, uh, Ambassador Nimchinsky, and Under Secretary uh, Newland will make some short statements. So if the press could uh, come forward. As Ukraine suffers under this awful, violent, brutal aggression, from Russia, she fights not only for her own sovereignty and territorial integrity, but for the freedom and rights of the entire democratic world. And we honor the sacrifice that Ukrainians are making every single day. We stand with you in solidarity. Cyprus, the countries of this region, the entire transatlantic family stands with you in support. Yes, for improvised explosive devices. Yes. Amazing, right? Talking about Russian lying, it started with the Russian lies about whether they would invade Ukraine to begin with, which, uh, you know, began with President Putin and spread all the way down. But now that disinformation continues talking about you know, all kinds of crazy things that the Ukrainians might do when in fact they're things that the Russians themselves are doing, including the war crimes that we see on the ground. So we all have an interest in exposing Russian disinformation, ensuring our citizens have the truth, um, and ensuring that Russian citizens also, to the extent we can, get the truth, despite the Iron Curtain that Putin has put down uh, over them. Today's ribbon cutting symbolizes our expanding relationship, including in security cooperation, in trade and investment, and in regional cooperation. But it's much more than that. It's a reflection of the common values and principles that under, undergird this relationship and this partnership. Values of democracy, of security, of respect for human rights. Okay. 